Hi everyone, here we've got VicoView 3 and let me share with you how to enable developer options on this device. So firstly, let's enter the settings and here we have to scroll down to the very bottom and tap on the system. Now let's tap on advanced and here we've got the about phone option, so let's enter. All we are looking for here is the build number, so uh, it is right here, so let's scroll down to the very bottom and right now we have to keep tapping on it until we will see that we are in a developer mode. And as you can see we've got the info, so we can go back in order to check and right here in the system settings um, we've got the developer options which uh, appeared right now, so let's tap on it and here we've got plenty of advanced settings which we can customize so for example we can uh, turn on or off the USB audio routing we can for example uh, change the simulate secondary displays we can show visual feedback for tabs here we've got some options connected to the Bluetooth and so on and so on so we've got plenty of advanced settings so in order to turn on the feature for example like here the pointer location uh, just tap on the switcher on it and as you can see it is immediately activated and applied obviously you can turn it off the same way and and it is disabled. If you can see the options without the switcher, for example, like in this Bluetooth audio codec, just tap on it in order to open much more advanced settings. So actually, this is it. If you are done with customization of developer options, if you want to turn them off, just tap on the switcher right here. And as you can see, uh, they are in, uh, immediately inactive. And after getting back, you can see that the developer options simply disappeared. But no worries, if you'd like to customize them again, just go back to the build number step and keep tapping. So actually that's all. This is how to enable developer options in your VicoView 3. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was helpful and if it was, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.